So if you have any questions, you can ask them now. It is Wrocław University. Was there natural light used there? Or no, no, no. It, it is artificial light. Uh, they are there are jacks, lifts, and 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 there's a light behind the. Uh, yes, we use discharge lamps behind the. Behind the windows, yeah, artificial sun. For me, the division is the following. There's a, there's a handheld camera, there's gimbal and steady cam. And, and each movement of the camera has its uh, characteristics. So handheld camera is m the, r the roughest one. And gimbal is something between the steady cam and the handheld camera. It is, does not have a, an ideal smoothness of movement of a steady cam. Sometimes steady cam sort of... Um, I don't like it because it's too perfect. The movement is is as if it was done by a machine and not a human being. That's why in this scene I wanted to add a bit of temperature and that's why we used gimbal so that it is not so perfect. This was an effect of flashback. It was done in a natural way. There's also an example there of using this camera Venice too. Of course, it was stinky and there was plenty of problems, ecological problems uh, in there, but the whole exposure was based on uh, w was based on uh, uh, torches. Uh, 
was there a white white reflector yes we used reflectors but the main source of light were, were just the torches Here we have a, a romantic uh, uh, rainfall. No, these are real drops. Maybe, but uh, I I'm trying not to use such things in post-production, like like water drops and halation. I'm trying to do as much as possible in a manual way, in a large cycle, in a show longer shows. This w it was the ninth it was a ninth um, episode you have to it's like 100 shooting days so there's a lot of transfers a lot of locations so you really have to be resilient and also Poland is doing better and better here but th there's still a long way to go when it comes to financial quality in comparison to the West, to 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 hone things even better because the sh American shows look like a feature movie. Here you can see there are certain drawback, sort of um, imperfections. Uh, this as arises from cost, but if you compare what happens now and what happened 50 years ago, it's a totally different world. It's difficult which way this streaming will be going whether I heard that that it's um, there th we have a, a, a fashion like it's fashionable to have less a smaller number of episodes in a in a f uh, season yeah it was tough we had to transfer from one region to another Krakow and Przemysz was playing Lwów and also we had shots in Lwów However, we played a lot in Lower Silesia, in Wrocław, in Legnica, in, in Kłodzko, so in the everything in the Lower Silesia. I do it in such a way that I'm preparing the whole feature, the, the whole uh, series 
in a, in a certain in certain colors, and I'm trying to color it not in post production, but I'm trying to color it on the set. So, using uh, using uh, colored foils on the on the f filters on the lamps, and, and the color grading is just the f uh, final cherry on top. It's just uh, honing the or final polish. There is a shot when he's standing next to a shed and gives the g the other guy flowers. This uh, m this murder flowers to this doctor. Th it's it's y you could feel it's cold. So basing on our my uh, cinematographic tests, we selected a filter. It was still still green, still green something. I selected it and I used it exactly in this at this moment. And when there's a, a different situation in the in an apartment or something, and I had a mm, I had a, uh, mm, a a copy book and I had the scene and the color of filters, uh, and the producer was complaining because I had half of a truck of of colored foils of filters, and I was exchanging them depending on the scene. So, when did it uh, on with the with the oil lamps or with torches? Then we have to correct what's happening mm, on the set. Even this uh, this blue halo is not from a C type CTB lamp but it is also a color that a color that we found for this this is my obses obsession about this to look for to find the solutions and the methods and I always have this uh, drawn out very very precisely So I'm creating this score, sc like a musical score of, of colors and the movement of camera that we are always agree on, on this. We talk about it with the director in the TV series. The more you have, you have more traditional solutions. Long takes, for example, are not used very often, even though we've managed to to smuggle in several such uh, solutions into this show so we didn't do everything on counter shots the counter shot is sometimes necessary you cannot do things without the counter, sh counter shot so we if you have any more questions Nice shot, but you could feel that this was sort of pressed so that the, the viewer could. It was that it was nice based on the colors. Yes, but these are certain rules of the game, and uh, you don't have to be afraid of them. So because if we would make a the romantic of that girl in some beaut beautiful s place, it becomes cynical. Then, it's, of course. The, that if, if your idea was that there the uh, for the film that there is some sort of a dawn this could have been certain action but the murderers are driving somebody outside of the city at the, at dawn and, and they kill him in the rising sun it's a different movie it's, it's a it's a world and you have to follow the rules of the world 
the, this is the world of the, the security forces, communist security forces, and those people. And sometimes it's it's not uh, you, tr you do not have to break the open door and do something to try to force yourself to be original. Uh, the, the cameraman was my friend Balta, Walter Sankovic. He has a very good feeling when he's working from from with his from his when he's shooting from hand and goes and is very skilled in walking around with gimbal. Yes, we were uh, studying uh, in in the same year. Walter is an interesting guy, even though he also debuted with a movie which will not bring him a lot of fame but it was a feature it was the last film of pa Patrick Vega uh, Vega speaks about Vega he was the he was at the DOP ah, I didn't see that so he had his debut and of course, these movies are, of course, massacred by 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 reviews by by critics. But but it is the best film from the visual perspective. Yeah. So he's doing a, a fiction movie now. Yes. Okay. So if the, you have no other questions, I think that should be the end. Thank you.